I do get recognized a lot, Christian Hubitsky confesses to Gold Derby when we proclaim him to be the face of, Survivor, David vs. Goliath, on the morning after he was eliminated. I try to keep the changes as small and as manageable as possible, he continues. I started my new job. I'm teaching a class. I don't talk about, Survivor, during the class. I just kind of do my business. I try to sort of treat it like it's normal, listen to our exit interview above. 1. Jarring story, Christian tells us, is that he recently went out to eat with his girlfriend on his birthday and only four other patrons were in the restaurant. What are the chances that I'll be seen, he recalls thinking. Approximately 1 in 40 Americans watch, Survivor, there's four people here. Very small. Sure enough, people get up from the table and say, can we have a photo? I'm like, you're kidding me, Christian's fellow castaways were trying to get him out of the game for so long that it became commonplace for him to receive votes at tribal council. I think I became a big target for a few reasons, he explains. The big one was that people seemed to like talking to me and like working with me. Angelina Keeley has a great secret scene where she explains why she's targeting me right after the merge. I was really trying to charm Angelina. She was like, yeah, I want to work with him, and then she caught herself and said, wait, if I want to work with him then everyone wants to work with him. What was Christian's reaction when Davey Rickenbacker stood up to play another idol at Tribal Council? Oh, I had no illusions that Davey would play an idol for me a second time, Christian readily admits. The only reason I knew he'd do it the first time was because he told me and we talked about it and he was motivated for a number of reasons to do it. I knew about his final seven idol. He told me about it and in fact we talked about how he should play it. Also in our Survivor podcast, Christian talks about the downfall of his Mason-Dixon alliance with Nick Wilson, whether he has any sour feelings about Gabby Pascuzzi turning on him last week, and who his dream final three would have been. Listen to our prior exit interviews with Pat Cusick, Jessica Pete, Jeremy Crawford, Fine Wynn, Natalia Zoka, Natalie Cole, Lursa Torres, Elizabeth Olsen, John Hennigan, Dan Rengering, Alec Merlino, Carl Boudreau and Gabby Pascuzzi. Be sure to make your predictions to influence our reality TV race track odds. You can keep changing your predictions until just before the next live episode airs on CBS. You'll compete to win a spot on our leaderboard and eternal bragging rights. See our contest rules and sound off with other fans in our reality TV forum. Read more Gold Derby Entertainment News.